Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Merrick Cell, and I'm back again with another video. And so today's video is going to be a hairstyles, hair, uh, athletic hairstyles video. And um, if you don't know, I do play volleyball and I am somewhat active. So I have a couple of hairstyles that um, I don't know would be helpful for you. Or something and I know that it's New Year's now so happy New Year's Merry New Year's happy New Year it's happy New Year so um yeah my hair looks a hot mess right now for this video but I'm just gonna stop talking and let's get on it. okay so we're just gonna get started what you'll need you need a hair tie and a comb maybe if you want to use the comb to like brush the sides but yeah so right now i'm just getting a section of hair and i'm starting to twist it tightly to the scalp of my head um you can take as big a section of you want as whatever but i'm just going to start grabbing hair and just twisting it to more of the crown of your head so yeah So now I'm just going to start gathering the hair and put it into a ponytail. And then we are done. This is what it looks like. Don't mind that little hair thing right there. That's just like a part of my baby hairs. So, uh, yeah. So this is what it looks like. Make sure you get all the hair in because I didn't get all the hair in in the back, but it's whatever. So the second hairstyle, yay. The second hairstyle is just like the first hairstyle. All you're doing is just, instead of the twist, you're just braiding it. And if you don't know how to French braid or Dutch braid, um, just leave it down in the comments below and I'll do like a more in-depth video on how to do it. But right now I'm just parting my hair into the section that I want it. Then you're just going to grab a section and split it into three parts. And then right now I'm just starting to French braid it. So I'm just braiding it um, and grabbing in hair. So you just want to keep doing the same thing over and over again. You're just braiding. So one section, the front section goes in the middle. Then you, I don't know what, oh, I messed up that part. And then you grab the back section, put it to the middle, front section, put it to the middle. Then you grab some hair, front section to the middle, back section to the middle. Um, like I said, you can just leave it down in the comments down below if you guys Want me to do a more in-depth video on how to French braid and how to Dutch braid. So, yeah. So, you're just going to keep going. Just like the twist, you're going to go. But instead of going all the way down to the crown of your head, you're just going to... Um, I'm just going to stop right about there, I think. Oh, no. Just grab a little more. I want to make sure I get all the hair from around my ears, and then I'm just going to stop right about behind my ear level, and then I'm just going to start, continue to braid the rest, not adding any more hair. So you're just going to braid all the way to the bottom. Now, 
Um, when you do this hairstyle, there's either you can just do what I did, what I did in this video, or you could um, tie the end of the uh, braid and then you just pull that back into the ponytail. If you just want to end it, you could have like a little strand of a braid in your hair. But I didn't do that. Um, I'm just grabbing my hair into a ponytail and um, I grabbed the braid and then as you can see, I twisted it because there was a little poof. Um, but I'll show you how to fix that. There was a little poof, so then I just undid the braid in the hair, too. Okay, now as you can see, there's like a little poof right there. So I'm going to use a bobby pin, and I'm going to open it up a bit wide. And then I'm just going to stick it, I'm just going to grab that piece and I'm going to stick it in through um, the hair right there to put the poof down. And as you can see, it fixed. And with that piece right there, it was really, really irritating me. And I didn't have like my, all my hair, I didn't have my like hair gel on the table. So uh, yeah, I just left it like that. And then you are done. Now on to the third hairstyle. My finger looks really weird there. Right now I'm just gathering up all my hair to more of the crown um, top part of my head. You can do it on the top part. You can do it on the crown. You can do it as high and as low as you want it. But this is just like a basic messy bun that I normally do. I normally do this bun all the time because I'm just like too lazy. So like when I go to practice or when I go... Do whatever I'm doing, I just do that. So I get it into a ponytail. Majority of the time, I don't put it into a ponytail first. I just twist it. As you can see, as I'm doing right there, I'm doing it pretty messily. So it doesn't like really matter. And then I'm just using it, and then I'm using another hair tie, and I'm also tying that to secure it. Then I'm just going to start pulling pieces of hair, spreading it out. Just to make it look more messy and yeah. And then you could pull like little pieces of hair as I did right now just to give it that more messy feel. So you know. So on to the fourth hairstyle. Yes, you um, need a comb, and then you'll need some hair ties, and yeah, you will need two to be exact. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna part my hair straight into the middle of my scalp. As you can see, I didn't really part it well because I don't, I didn't have my um, actual parting comb. I just used a comb that I found. But, yeah. So, I'm just going to try to part it as best as I can. You don't have to part it perfectly straight in the middle, but somewhat. You could also do a part to the side if you like if you like that better. But, what we're going to do is... We're going to grab the hair tie and I'm going to um, tie the other half of my hair. And then, uh, yeah. So because it, you don't want it to get tangled and into the mess of the other side. Okay, so now what I'm going to do, I'm going to do a Dutch braid. And this is a, like a, it's a French braid, but a Dutch French tail, whatever. I don't know what you want to call it, but um, this is just me braiding it. I'm going to do all the way down. So what I'm doing is you're going to grab a piece of hair. You put the side I, I can't tell whatever you're gonna put the side into the other side and then other side and the other side <laughs> I'm kidding you're gonna put um, the outside to the middle then the other outside to the middle and then you're gonna grab hair outside to the middle other outside to the middle and then grab some hair that's basically the pattern that I follow I don't do this professionally I don't I'm not a professional um, I taught myself how to do it. I watched videos on how to do it and all this other stuff. So that's how I learned basically how to do it. Um, so, yeah. That's just me Dutch braiding.
So I'm just gonna keep on going. So just braid, braid, braid. And I speed this up a bit, but this is the fastest it can go because I didn't do it in time lapse. So, yeah. So then, instead of you're gonna stop more, t you're gonna stop at your neck, um, right below at the bottom, and then you're just gonna tie it. You don't want to go all the way down because the style is to just like tie the little bottom of it. And uh, yeah, we're gonna do the same thing to the other side. And um, yeah. So there it is. So it can be. It's pretty simple if you do know how to braid like i said if you do know how to braid or french braid or anything like that um this one might be a little bit difficult but um yeah my arms were on fire after doing this hairstyle because it took forever and then my arms were all up in the air so yeah that was a good arm exercise and again there's a little bump in my hair because i didn't pull that piece but um what you're gonna do you could just use a bobby pin and clip it down as you can see i did then you can do the same thing to the other side you're just gonna tie it off and then i took a bobby pin and i grabbed that and i squished it down and I put the bobby pin underneath the braid, and it hit it, and yeah, that's the finish hairstyle. So the fifth hairstyle, um, I'm just gonna continue. To, I'm just gonna take that piece out, and then I'm gonna um, make three more sections with out of that piece, and then I'm just gonna braid it all the way down. And honestly, I think I'm getting sick because I had to keep my nose was like really, really clogged. I needed to blow my nose. And yeah, I was tired because I stayed up till like really late coming up with video ideas and things for this channel coming up in the future. So stay tuned for that and be excited. So I'm just going to braid all the way down to the very bottom um, yeah, I think I'm gonna take an elastic, uh, or a rubber band, whatever you want to call it. It's clear rubber band. You can get them at Dollar Tree, Walmart, wherever. And then I'm just tying the bottom of that. You could also use like a regular hair tie, but I like using the clear elastics because you can't really see them. And, uh, you don't have like this big humongous club of circle on your hair. So, yeah. Then I'm gonna do the same thing to the other side. So I'm just going to grab those pieces and then go braid all the way down. Do you guys like the new background? I'm really liking it. Like, I'm really feeling it. I think this might be, like, the new background for now. Because I'm trying to use, like, all of the sections of my room because I'm just starting to get tired of the... Ooh, excuse me. I'm starting to get tired of that wallpaper stuff. So, the sixth hairstyle. I think this is the last hairstyle. Um, this is, like, really, really easy to do. I normally do this a lot when I have my curly hair. If you guys don't know, I have naturally curly hair. And um, it works out so much better when you have curly hair. And this is just, like, the poof ball thing. Whatever. And as you can see, that piece was not working out very well. So I just grabbed a bobby pin and I bobby pinned that down. And yeah. 
driving class at seven in the morning. And besides some college credit, yeah, you kind of. So, yeah, that is what the finished product looks like. Okay, so this is the end of the video. I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and comment down below what other videos you guys like to see. And um, also, um, don't forget to subscribe. And also check out my um, description box because I always have my previous videos. And um, all my social media links are always linked down below if you want to go check those out. And, um, yeah. I'm going to be filming, I think, I'm going to be filming, um, I have a lot of video ideas, but I don't, I'm trying to pick out a schedule, so where I like, uh, upload on certain days, I know we'll be uploading every single Sunday, I know Sunday for sure, and, um, I don't know, maybe, um, I might be doing, uh, Sunday, Saturday, I don't know. I'm going to be doing, I don't know, if I should try maybe doing one every single day. Um, how many times you want me to post every single week um, and stuff like that. So just let me know all that stuff down below. And um, yeah, I'll see you in my next video. Bye.